my name is Danny, and this is Crafting with Sinzan. Today, in honor of the anniversary of Operation Dynamo, I thought it might be fun to draw some little ships. Can't draw? Don't worry. After a quick history lesson, I'll show you how to use your own little ship to make a masterpiece like this. In May 1940, Allied forces found themselves trapped on the beaches near Dunkirk, unable to escape to larger vessels because the beaches were wide and flat, so the vessels could not get close. Their only hope? A fleet of nearly 450 privately owned ships, boats and barges from the coasts and rivers of southern England, requisitioned or volunteered for service to work alongside the Royal Navy as part of Operation Dynamo. These flat bottom boats could get close enough to the beaches for soldiers to climb onto them and be ferried out to larger ships. Between May 20th and June 4th, 1940, these ships managed to move over 300,000 troops onto larger vessels. These may have been little ships, but they saved a mighty large number of lives. Now you may be wondering why we're in the pitch black right now. But that's because in order to draw our little ships, we are going to be using shadows. So you can see right here, we've got a very simple model, and you can see that by shining a light across it, you're getting a shadow that we can trace. So right now the shadow is a bit fuzzy, but if I move the light away, you'll see that it gets sharper and sharper. Now I can make it bigger, just by moving the light down, or I can make it smaller by moving the light up. And once you decide where you want to put it, it's a very simple job just to trace the shape of the little ship. Now you can use simple models like that. You can use slightly more complicated models. This one right here. If you don't have a model, well, if you look back through our videos, then you will see one on origami boats, just like this one. And again, move it farther away, and it gets sharper. Now you can even, if you're feeling very, very, very brave, do some very complicated ship models. But they're a lot trickier to do. You can see right like that. Now, if you don't have a light source, you can actually just use the sun, which I would be doing if it wasn't an overcast day here. And that is how you can use models to draw a little ship of your own. We know of at least two Dunkirk little ships in our discovery areas. The Sundowner, which is featured in the Ramsgate Harbour's digital low tide trail on our website, and the Thames Sailing Barge Pudge, which is still sailing today at Malden. Well, there you have it. That's how we can use a physical model of a ship and with some shadows to turn it into a drawing of the same ship. Now, we have lots more information on our website, including a brand new blog about the Thames barges and their role in Operation Dynamo. And I hope you've had fun today. Please do send us in a copy of your drawing if you do make one. There are lots more activities similar to this on the Young Archaeologist website. And next week, we'll be back making the very coolly named Bog Butter.